Hey everyone, today we are going to solve very easy problem, but it is mostly asked in interview and sometimes it becomes little tricky when somebody is not writing delete command or update command or finding duplicates from many days. So one has to practice the, this little bit. So today we are going to solve uh, this duplicate email. Here we are having one table that is person table where it has two column ID and email. Cool. And we have to write an SQL query to report all the duplicates email. So we can easily solve this problem if we understand and if we can implement row number. Perfect. Let me just show you. This is our, let's suppose if this is our input table. And we apply row number. Cool. And then we do partition by email address. Partition by email. Then we will be having input uh, uh, output something like one. This is the same email, right? And this will have two. Right? And this will have one. Let me just pass this also. Order by ID ascending. Cool. And we can just filter out all those results where row number is not equal to one. So this will out. This will be the duplicate value. Cool. This is very simple. So just let me just write the query with. I'm using with to create temporary table temp table as select email and let's just have this row number from person to select email from tem table and we need to pass distinct right distinct where let me just call this as r number where r num column is not equal to one Let me just run it. Let me just submit it. Perfect. So we are able to solve this problem. It's very easy problem. If you understand the basic concept of using row number, that is the Windows function, then you can easily solve this problem. Okay. So let's meet in the next video and let's try to solve some more interesting problem. And if you have learned something from it, please like subscribe or comment in my in the comment sections bye for then thank you bye.